October is known for falling leaves, pumpkins, the Baseball World Series. But did you know that it is actually Domestic Violence Awareness Month? The Shelter for Abused Women and Children is on the front lines. And here to tell us more is Karen Harmon and also Rebecca Thompson. Good morning, ladies. So great Hi. to have you on the show. <laughs> Good Thank morning. You. Appropriately wearing your purple today. Yes. Uh, so let's <laughs> talk about purple, though. It is uh, Domestic Violence Awareness Month. So why purple? Well, purple is a color that's supposed to signify uh, survival, all also a dedication towards ending domestic violence. Mm -hmm. And before we, I know you guys have a lot of uh, events coming up to kind of help raise awareness, but talk a little bit about the shelter and why it is important to raise awareness about domestic violence. Yeah, so a lot of people um, that may be in a situation where there is domestic violence don't necessarily recognize right. they're a victim. And so it's important for us, to, for them to know what are some, some, some of the signs when mm -hmm. someone is controlling you, mm -hmm. uh, whether financially, emotional. It doesn't just have to be physical, right. but there is a resource there available to you where you can seek help and it be completely confidential. Mm -hmm. And I think, Rebecca, sometimes it's hard, you know, you, know, it's, you, you don't always want to turn to necessarily family or friends so just to have that resource there is, is a great tool right absolutely and the purpose of domestic violence month is really to create awareness that the shelter exists mm -hmm. and for those individuals that may be too afraid to reach out right. for services to know that they can do that confidentially right. so we love what you guys do but uh, even more we're raising awareness by adding a little fun uh, to to these events too so you have some great events coming up to really raise awareness what do we got going on ladies we do there's a lot <laughs> there's many many events um, one of the newest ones is that we're gonna have a 5k fun run on Marco Island which is great because we've never had an event um, on the island before. It's gorgeous so it's, it's up there, too. Yes. And that community will now be able to become um, involved. We also have uh, a painting with a purpose event at Vino's Picasso. Okay, we love Vino's Picasso. Butterfly. They've been on the blend before, too. They're so. wonderful. Um, and additionally, we have a flash mob, which is going to be very, very fun. It's going to be at Mercado. This. Yeah, it's going to be great. We're hopefully going to have a huge turnout, and people will be able to have some um, some fun and dance while also raising awareness. Yeah, for we're looking at video awareness. right now. This is actually last year's uh, flash mob. So, I mean, a lot of work goes into this, by the way. You've got this choreographed, and people are ready to rock, right? Yes, yeah. and it's posted on our website. So, for any of the viewers that would like to join us, please come help us and raise awareness. No dancing experience needed. No dancing right? experience no. needed. We don't have any. <laughs> Dancers of all levels are welcome. All you have to do is wear purple and dance to the music. You know, you don't have to have all the moves exactly. Um, it's more about <laughs> raising awareness. Yeah, for uh, having some fun for a worthy cause. And you saw their website uh, right there uh, if you want more information. And usually for all of the events, I know you said you have a lot going on. It's Domestic Violence Awareness Month. So during the month of October, there's a, a lot of ways you can help raise awareness as well. So website is the what number one resource if they want to check out what you guys are up to and mm -hmm. Yes. And yeah, so if you go to like naplesshelter.org slash DVAM, that's D-V-A-M, uh -huh. there's a whole list there of all the events we're having, so you can support us in many different ways. I love it. Thank you, ladies, so much. And again, check out that flash mob, another one coming your way. Uh, get your groove on and help raise awareness. And then if you want to learn more, again, head to their website, and they've got that 24-hour crisis line. So domestic violence, as I always say, does not discriminate. It can happen to anybody, but we just uh, love what you guys do for us. So thank you. Thank you.